video is going to be all about my new hair. A lot of questions as to what hair I'm wearing and whether if it's a full weave or a U-part wig. I decided to make this quick clip to kind of give you guys a little bit more infos about the hair. This is the same hair that I had in, in my 500 plus subscriber giveaway video that I did about a year ago. Um, this is the Divalicious um, Indian Lush Curls. That Unfortunately, the hair has been discontinued, so it's no longer being offered. I do apologize. I didn't even realize I had this hair in my hair stash till I started seeing a lot of curly hair. I guess for spring, a lot of people are doing curly hair, and I'm like, hold on, wait a minute. I have curls similar to this. So I went into my hair stash, and I pulled out the old curls. I had it, and I washed it and made it into a U-part wig. So this is a U-part wig. Um, I did not film it because... I didn't think you guys wanted to see me sewing a U-part wig because there's so many videos here on YouTube about U-part wigs. So it's the same traditional U-part wig. I'm going to show you a little clip of what I used um, to make the U-part wig. So let's have a look at that. Alright guys, so let me go ahead and show you guys what I'm going to be using for this specific wig. So for this wig, I'm going to use this dome cap and I got this from my local beauty supply store. And as you can see, I don't know if the camera is picking up the price. It is $2.99. So that's the cap that I'm going to be using. I'm also using this. Um, I couldn't find my needle and thread. I went ahead and purchased a mini um, needle and thread set. It has two needles and two threads in here. I'm not going to use the straight one. I'm going to be using the curved needle to stitch um, the hair onto the cap. And these are the curls that I'll be using on my wig. This is the Divalicious Lush Curls. This hair is no longer available on the Divalicious Brazilian um, store anymore. It was the Indian Lush Curls. Unfortunately, it's been discontinued. I do know that um, Divalicious is currently working on a new curl pattern. So unfortunately, if you're looking for these specific curls, it's no longer available. So this is um, curls that I had about, say, last um, summer. I had these curls last summer. Um, I wore it once, took it out, and washed and conditioned it. And this is the curls that I am going to be using. So I have here three bundles, and this is a 18, 16, and a 14. Um, because I'm going for a Kelly Rowland inspired look, I will be cutting down the 18 inch to make it more bigger. These are the things that I actually use for the um, for the wig. It's actually my first U part wig. I've never worn a wig before, but it's so convenient. I don't know where I have been and why I haven't worn a wig. I can switch back and forth in between here, so that's gonna be my new thing now. I haven't permed my actual hair for almost two months. My new growth uh, makes it easier to blend in. I use the Herbal Essence um, Hello Hydration Curling, um, I guess is the Curl Defining Shampoo to wash the hair and then to define the curls, I use the Styling Gel. So it's... Um, it's also a little hydration as well. Not use it all the time. I only use it when I wash the hair because I don't like to put too much products in my hair because I feel like it weighs down the hair a lot. So when I wash the hair and the hair is wet, I would basically put the cream in to define the curls and just hang it to air dry or put it on my mannequin head to basically dry. Put on the wig and then I kind of poof it up like this. And then I basically put the rods in the front for about maybe five minutes and then I take it out. You don't want to put the perm rods in for too long because you're going to have like a really tight pigtail. So it would kind of like stand up if you leave it in for too long. So I don't leave it in no more than five minutes because as soon as even two minutes it curls. I hope I've answered all the questions. If you guys want to see how I blend um, out the leave out, let me know and I'll do a separate video on that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any other questions or if I left out anything, leave your comments below and I'll be more than glad to answer them. So thanks so much for watching guys and see you all in my next video. Bye guys.